My name is Khaula Jameel and I'm a photographer, documentary photographer based in uh, Karachi and uh, I do a project called Humans of Karachi as well. Uh, I think what inspired me to start Humans of Karachi was the fact that uh, there was a lot of uh, unpleasant things, stuff being spoken about Karachi in international media. Uh, fourth most unlivable city, most violent city in the world and things like that and I felt like that was just one part of uh, the truth you know it's, it's a single story uh, of the city and it's not the complete representation I think it's very difficult to give a complete representation of any city and the violent narrative was just something that bothered me and I felt like a project like Humans of New York was doing so well to show diversity and various stories in a place like New York and I know for a fact that Karachi has a lot of diversity and similar if not you know more hard-hitting stories coming from you know the landscape that we come from so I thought why not it's a great project it's a great way to show the different stories and you know challenge that concept of it being the most violent and the most unlivable when that's not a fact it's just a impression okay. one special moment for humans of Karachi uh, has always been the story of uh, a fruit seller's son who uh, when I wrote his story out it went so viral and uh, because he'd got an admission in McGill and he really had no chances of going but uh, because of that story it got so popular and viral that uh, everyone rallied for him and he got to go so that's a success story for us so citizenship uh, means to me means uh, ownership ownership of where you are whether it's your city or your home or your location and I think for Karachiites um, it's this feeling of ownership that really uh, translates into citizenship it's it's taking ownership of uh, not just the space but your actions as well and with the, each story in Humans of Karachi uh, I hope to you know bring forth stories that reflect this uh, sentiment in whether it's personal stories or or any other kind of stories but uh, you'll notice that all of them have this connection to Karachi and it's uh, to do with you know the fact that they feel like they own a bit of it in one way or the other.